get ready. Gardaland is a theme park in Italy operated by Merlin Entertainments. It's home to some world-class attractions such as Raptor, Oblivion Black Hole and Ikorsari. In this video we want to take a look at what food options are available in the park. Italy is world renowned for its food, but does this translate to the restaurants in Gardaland? Well, keep watching and we'll offer our opinion. Before we get into it, here's just a quick reminder to like the video if you haven't already and subscribe to our channel if you enjoy our content. Now let's get back to it, get ready. Number 5. Ristorante Aladino This Arabian themed restaurant makes it onto our top 5 due to its amazing theming rather than the food. As the oldest of the restaurants in Gardaland, Ristorante Aladino is a cornerstone of dining in the park. It's a self-service restaurant with a vast amount of space inside. The food quality may not be the best in the park, but the price is fairly affordable and the food is good for what you get. Even though it's Middle Eastern themed, the food options are mostly Italian, with a variety of pastas and pizza on offer. The key benefits for us though is that due to its large space and self-service system, you're unlikely to need to queue or wait for seats to become available, even on busy days. Gardaland can get really hot in the summer months, so this place offers great respite from the sun and heat. This is a great option for grabbing some quick food right in the middle of the park and continuing on with your day. Number 4. Merlin Stube. Merlin Stube is one of the fast food restaurants in Gardaland that we rate pretty highly. Following a medieval theme and set in Merlin's castle, Merlin Stube offers traditional German fare. The likes of bratwurst and schnitzel and other meats are available, with traditional sides like potatoes and chips, and beer is even included in the set menus. A large selection of beers are available here, and a meal and beer combination will cost about 14 euro, which is okay if you ask us. If you're looking for good food and drink in a casual setting, you can't go wrong with Merlin's Dubé. The theming inside is great, if not a little cheesy. The food is of a high quality and affordable price, and you can get in and out pretty quickly to enjoy more time on the rides. Number 3. Trattoria di Captain Hook Trattoria di Captain Hook is one of the best themed restaurants in Gardaland. It's one of two restaurants set in the pirate themed area of the park. The restaurant overlooks the lake of the land and offers great views while you dine. Should you sit inside, you'll find yourself dining in an old pirate village. The menu is made up of pizza and pasta options, and this is where Italy's food reputation begins to show inside the park. The quality of the food is top notch and reasonably priced for what you get. One downside can be that the wait times and service times can get long on busier days in Gardaland. But again, the theming is great, so if it's an experience you're after, you'll definitely find it here. Number 2. Silver Saloon Silver Saloon is a strange restaurant, but definitely has one of the best food propositions on offer from any of the restaurants in Gardaland. Set in a very authentic feeling western saloon, this building will be apt for a high-end restaurant. Instead, what's on offer is really cheap pizza. Silver Saloon has an extensive pizza menu with prices ranging from 7 to 10 euro. The pizza is high quality akin to what you find in Italy as opposed to what you would expect to find in a theme park. It's handmade and beech wood fired. Soups, salads and other various sides are also available. Silver Saloon ranks so highly on our list as it's honestly a hard offer to pass up. You get a themed experience, tasty food and a light bill, the perfect triad of theme park dining in our opinion. It's also a great option for kids as there's plenty of space and seating. Number 1. Locando del Corsaro Nero Locando del Corsaro Nero ranks as our favourite of the restaurants in Gardaland. It has some of the best theming found in the park and is the other of the restaurants found in the pirate themed area. Located next to Trattoria di Captain Hook, you'll dine on a boat and will have the choice between sitting on deck, which is outside, or below deck if the weather isn't great. The theming is fantastic and worth a look even if you're not considering eating here. The food on offer is primarily seafood but also has some non-seafood options and much like the previous two entries the food is certainly of an Italian quality. The prices are also reasonable for what's on offer. It can get a little busy given its location but going at it off peak time can offer a prime experience. If you're a seafood lover this spot is a must do for your next trip to Gardaland. If you enjoyed this video, check out our favourite restaurants in Europa Park or Disneyland Paris on screen now. 
That concludes our list of top restaurants in Gardaland. Which restaurant in this park is your favourite? Would your top 5 look different to ours? Be sure to let us know in the comments below. And now you're ready.